guys good day uh, for today um, I'm going to teach you on how to make a call transfer if you have a inbound or outbound call they can use this kind of a transfer call to another agent using the agent agent screen so ready for now I have a uh, I'm using outbound call with a uh, dialable lead 16 so uh, so I'm going to log in my agent so my agent 101 and okay then click submit this is my agent 102 so it's also like in the agent 101 it's a little bit slow to that okay so my bg phone will change and click on web phone and then i will make a dial so it's now Okay, uh, so if the caller or the customer they want to speak from, I want to speak from another agent or um, the agent I speak before, so now I will just, just make a part call, always make a part call for the agent, then click on the transfer conference. Okay, for now we need to set up this one because right now if you hit select here, so you cannot, you cannot see the transfer. So for now I will just hang up the call then I will make a logout first then I will go back to my to my agent then click on the campaign on the admin click on a campaign and then modify the campaign So we need to modify the settings on here. First of all, I'll, we need to select the allow inbound blended to yes for the dial method. So that uh, when we transfer the agent, they can answer the queue. So we need to change this change from the inbound to from the manual to inbound manual, and then going down. Then allow transfer group. You need to also click on yes, then submit. And then going down again so allow in group so you need always check this one the agent direct and the agent director then submit and then we'll see again our the transfer group you we'll click on login submit so let's see here our so that I can see on the report Okay, so when when the agent <coughs> when the agent login, so you need to select a group. You need to select the agent direct. So then submit. Okay. So this one I will log out again. Okay. So we have now uh, ready and the next dial number. So I will make a next call again. So from here. Okay, I have a live call. So wait, I will log in my second agent. This is the agent 102, and I'm using the uh, agent 101. So the caller takes on agent 101, and then we're going to transfer it to agent 102. So same process. Just click and submit. Okay. Okay. So the agent they, uh, they make a call and then but the customer they want to speak to another agent then we need to click uh, just okay just always spark the call and click the transfer group and then uh, if you see here you, you already have a function for the transfer conference function so select the agent direct group and then click on the agents ok 
okay then click the agent 102 and then dial them with customer dial with customer or park with dial with customer all the same so if you see they are uh, if you see they are uh, dialed then you need to check on the or click on here so we have an agent and spark or still no call sync key for the agent 102 Oh, maybe it's the call in park. So if I grab the call again, and I believe the call. So wait, I don't know why. Why I can select here? So I will. Ah, okay, so I got an error on my line, so I will hang up this call. Uh, I will make uh, another call, so... Okay, call in please. Okay, and then just do uh, park the call, or click on the transfer conference, so much better just park the call transfer the call select the agent ok, double click and dial with customer so if we check in our agent screen still is number process the call ok, so I think they have an error on my end but if we check so let's see here uh, okay, I have an error, so I'm about to find out. And so I will grab the call. I will. Just hang up again the call. <coughs> okay, I will do another. Let's call it. Okay, and then click on the transfer conference. So, select the group. And then select the agent. Agent 102. Select the automotive call. And then park customer and dial. Okay, let's do to that. Okay, then I will leave the... So, if the uh, if you see the call is already on the agent group, so you will now you leave the three way call, and then if you go on your second agent, they will have a one call, and then if you uh, if the agent wants to answer, just click the end so that they can ready to answer the call, and just wait a few seconds, minutes, and the call will appear on the agent. So, I have an difficulties, so uh, slow. Okay, so the call already appears. So, if you hear single agent, the A call is from agent 101. So, we have successfully transferred our calls to agent 101. And then, I will make a hang up. And then, to, uh, agent 102. <coughs> and then we're gonna make uh, this is uh, this is agent one oh one and this is my agent 102 so for now i will make a call using the using agent 102 so i will click the next dial number so make another call Okay, 
view and then we have a live call so we go into click on transfer components select the group so we have already selected the agent direct and click the agent so we're going to transfer to agent 101 so just click a uh, park customer core or dial customer list and click the also tip check i will select the park customer dial okay wait uh if you hear some hold music on the agent side so they can now leave the three way call okay. and then the call already transfer here so if you see we have a call waiting a call from agent 101 so the num uh okay and then going to answer the call again on agent 101 just click on ready so i'm going to 102 okay and wait to answer okay so we have already successfully transferred the call so uh okay so we have successfully so our and then okay so our changes we made is only on the campaign only the campaign only the campaign settings so so the changes are made is only the enable the agent allow inbound and blended from no to yes and then the dial method from manual to inbound man so inbound call and manual child they can do in the lower part uh, allow inbound group the agent direct the default group we check it and allow transfer group the agent direct we we'll check it then submit and uh, then we are ready to check in the call and for the agent process uh, if the agent login they need to select the they need to select the group or the in group so that uh, they can allow agent to make a transfer call so select and submit okay so for some reason some agent they will for uh, they will forget to select the group uh, so we can set up it manual uh, automatically using here using on our thing here so just go to your in so that uh, agent they will not select select group so they will automatically assign to the group okay, select here Okay, so they will not uh, they, we will skip this one so agent they did not select manually the group so we will assign it using uh, on the inbound and then select here go into town so always select here so that the agent they will not select every time they log in the in group and then go to user modify the agent and then choose in group so just one agent problem you can uh, you can set this on zero and then submit and then you're gonna go to our agent two same okay and submit also we have here the for the inbound group campaign so we are already there and then goodbye okay just we gonna go here and log in again let's see if, uh, so we will they will automatically skip the inbound group selection okay so okay they will automatically just click so so no more group needs to select Okay, I will try again. So I will make a dial call again, then transfer it to our. Okay, and then wait, I will log in my agent 102. And then. Okay, 
so this is the agent 102 and then I will transfer again the call uh, just click the park or so okay then click the transfer conference so the agent direct group and then say, click on the agent okay so click on the agent 102 okay dial with customer okay just wait okay if I if you if you see the holding sound on the agent they can now leave the three way call and then so let's see on the report where is the call okay and then Uh, we have uh, one call waiting so they have uh, successfully transferred to agent and then if you want to answer just set on ready and the call will get okay uh, we have successfully done our tutorial now on how to on how to make a transfer call to another agent uh, for our uh, outbound campaign also this the also the kind transfer call they will work also on the inbound so okay so uh, this is all for now so we have done setting up and uh, show you on how to make a transfer call and campaign so that uh, they will manage the transfer call to another agent guys don't forget to like and share my channel hb hb tutorial so for more more uh, basic settings about busy dial and and more so uh, that's all for now and thank you don't forget to like and subscribe and share my channel hb tutorial okay thank you and have a nice day